Hey there, YouTube. My name is Tyler, and I am Mr. Game and Beer. Welcome back to Let's Play Baldur's Gate Enhanced Edition Co-op with John and Jason. Hi. And we are about to go into the Flaming Fist compound. Flaming Fist. Flaming Fist. I can't find ah, the door. Sir, oh, it's behind me. It's good to see you again. How have things gone? Mm. We learned that an ogre mage holed up in the sewers was responsible for all the disappearance. Says. He had several carrion crawlers that would steal out in, at night to carry off random victims. The crawlers used their hapless prey as food while the ogre mage took any valuables they might have. Uh, you've done a good job and earned your bonus in full. Do you have any of the items possessed by the ogre's victims? I'm sure their families would like to have something to remember of their loved ones. We know for a fact that the Sashen Star family lost a daughter to those creatures. She had a signet ring, a, a ring inset with a ruby. It was there, I didn't take it. Sorry, we didn't find anything. Did we not loot the place? You didn't say yes, we did? There was no option to say yes, we did. There was only sorry, we didn't find anything. There wasn't the second one? There was no second oh, one. That was all the one. one. Oh, I saw the second one. I didn't see the second one. Weird. Either. Okay, well, that's too bad. Well, uh, I'm going to need some people to do some investigating of the Iron Throne. I'm just going to finish up some paperwork, then I'll be just outside the main doors of the Flaming Fist compound. If you wish to discuss the Iron Throne, just come talk to me there. Did we take stuff from his hold, don't know? His hold. Yeah, we took tons of stuff. Okay. The Ogre Mages. Oh, yeah. <laughs> What's your business here? Deltos? Uh, I don't want any of these things. We're here to see Scar. I've been told to expect, but I just walked. Okay, problem. bye. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, he's right up. Thanks. I am we didn't take any damage word. in the sewers, did we? Oh, you took four, Jason. Yeah, I took Hello. one four. Archer Dartman, I have another job for you. This one involves a group you have dealt with in the past, the Iron Throne. Duke Elton himself wishes to speak to you about this. Will you come with me? Uh, of course we'll come, especially if we have an audience with the Grand Duke. Just follow me. I'll take you to the Flaming Fist compound. The Grand Duke is waiting for us. Oh, here. Duke. Oh. Oh. Here he comes. He's got a Flaming word. Fist on his back. Oh. Let me introduce you to Grand Duke Elton. One of the lords of the city, commander of the Flaming Fist, and member of the Lord's Alliance. I am glad to see that you have come. <laughs> I know that such a meeting is unusual, but in these circumstances it is necessary. I would first ask what involvement you have had with the merchant society known as the Iron Throne. Ah, we've learned that they're involved in a plot that threatens the stability of your city. From what I've been told, you have been quite a thorn in the side of the Iron Throne. I'm interested in you because of the obvious hatred that you hold for them. Their recent activities have been brought to my attention. I am very dubious about the intent of the throne. I think it is far too easy to blame the recent caravan raids and the iron shortage on the Zentorim. Though the evidence does point to them, they do not have much profit while the Iron Throne has everything to gain. I have much to concern me right now, especially with tension rising between our city and the nation of Arm. Unfortunately, my hands are tied. I can't act against the Iron Throne until I have evidence of their wrongdoing. That's, of course, where you come in. I need a small group of spies to break into the Iron Throne headquarters and see if they can find any proof of the Iron Throne's involvement with the caravan raids. If you do this for me, you'll be paid extremely well. Two thousand gold to divide amongst yourselves. What is your answer? Um, hmm. Consider us hired. You've made a wise decision. It is a difficult mission that I give you, but I'm sure that you have the wherewithal to make it through. Return and report to me once you feel you have enough information to use against the Iron Throne. We'll be back as soon as possible. We're just rolling in money now. It will yeah, be right? so much money. Not that we weren't before, but... We should retire. <laughs> yeah, let's just retire. This will be our last job, and then we'll retire. We're not in it for the money. Where guys, am I? Am I still upstairs? People. You guys get severed? Yeah. Yeah, I don't think I have control. No. I got control of everybody. You're all mine. Oh. Yeah. No, Where I've been possessed. Archer Dodman, no. <laughs> Your soul is mine. <laughs> no! Where are we going? 
Uh, I think it's to the uh, to the right. Ah, the right. Exit stage right. Iron Throne stage right. Iron Throne on your right. Are we actually going to like the Iron Throne like building? Yeah, the headquarters. Yeah. Oh God. So we're busting in there and just killing them all. <laughs> I think we're investigating. Oh. Subterfuge. Oh. So yeah, we're gonna bust in there and kill them all. Sick. <laughs> That is probably the easiest course of action, considering our party. Yeah. The Iron Throne. Alright. Just go in the front door, no big deal. Yeah. <laughs> we're here to subterfuge! It's not like we're gonna try to get in through that sewer in the basement. Out! Away! Fly where you can! There'll be madness here and I can stand it no longer. Calm down and explain yourself, good sir, that I may understand you better. Calm down, calm down, while Saravox acolytes practice their magic cacophony above me. I dare say not, stranger, I dare say not at all. Good, good talk. <laughs> Saravox. will be done. Who's that? Hey. Well, we've heard that name before, I think. Sup, homie? Welcome to the Iron Throne Citadel. Could you please state what business brings you here? Should I try to bribe him? I don't think so. You think he's that dedicated? No, no, man. If I were to give you these 200 gold, would you not ask any questions and let us in? You don't have no. any questions. Come on in. Oh, thank you. No, that was there was one good. option for 100 and one option for 200. Yeah, oh, so I was like, yeah, 200. <laughs> done. We oh, can't afford a, that right now, John. There's a cellar here as well. Oh, cellar? We can do cellar. Or a basement, rather. Cellar. Mm. Oh, guard. Hey, no one's supposed to be down here. State your business. Before I have to give you the beets. <laughs> These beets are delicious. Oh, <laughs> uh, don't get so excited. We're just checking out some wares that we bought from the Iron Throne. I wasn't told. I think you're lying. I Whoa. beat up all five of you. Sorry, man. <laughs> Who did Bailoff just stab him? No, I did. Looked like Bailoff stabbed him. Looks like there's a secret room back. Oh, it's not very this. secret. This I like. Secure a room for us at once. What? Wait, pardon me. What are you talking about? Okay, Bailoff. <laughs> hmm? Not a problem. Uh, I guess he's just. You drunk, Bailoff? Go home. <laughs> yeah. He's just happy that it's so. Uh, such a rich building. Mm. I guess so, yeah. Have Hello. you looked at all these things? John, you should leave that male yeah, corpse down here. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I like <Sabotage>. this. <laughs> uh, some protection scrolls. Ooh. You should leave the other corpse you have. Some gold, well. some potions. I'm not leaving the child. Uh, genius, insulation, antidote, and storm giant. Pass them to the potion keeper. The keeper. Potion. Potion. Get your potions. Potion keeper. Someone is encumbered and slow. Yeah, Kagane is, and his potion container is full. <laughs> All right. Okay. Um. Protection from cold. Does he have any frost giant or cloud giant in that bag? Protection from acid. Uh, let's see. No. Or antidote. Oh, he's got cloud giant. Yeah. Okay, I'll take the cloud giants. I guess. Eventually I'll run out of frost and just have to upgrade. It was just one, unfortunately. And this antidote... Yeah, color seems strange somehow. It's cursed for sure. Mm. We'll just drop it on the ground then. I did. Oh, okay. I, I did. I say you, I did. I'm gonna drink it. Trey Fetty. Oh, these are uh, Baylos gauntlets here. Oh. I think this must also be his you, cloak. You can't wear those. Oh. Are you going through my inventory? No, sir. I oh, I threw those on Kagane when I had too much to carry. It will be done. Those bracers were plus two with missile weapons. Mm -hmm. with they were also keeping Dorans, them right? in case we got Dorans, uh, a sixth yeah. party member. Yeah, they were Dorans. Who's got the scroll case? 
Um, I think Cocaine does. Scrolly scroll. Oh, where have you where have you gone? Where have you gone? Mm -hmm. Upstairs. Yeah. They left us. Not a problem. <laughs> Alright, let's keep let's keep doing our thing here while we Let's learn of our Let's go up the old stairs. Where do you think you're going? Uh, the fifth floor. Saravok asked us to deliver an important message to his acolytes. Hmm. <laughs> Better you than me. Working with that crowd can be downright creepy some days. Yeah, creepy, are they? I'll be sure to pass that on. I I spoke out of, of, out of turn. My apologies. I'm, I'm very sorry, sir. Matt, sir, don't tell them, please. You don't know what they'll do. They're so good. They're so very good. They're not creepy at all. I'm sorry. <laughs> Jeez. With ease. That was mean. <laughs> Poor Dratan. Dratini. Poor little Dratini. Uh, second floor is totally clear. Two. <clears throat> the turd. What's in the turd? There's a merchant on the turd and some tables. Uh, oh, and a guard, of course. You there, what are you doing here? I don't recognize you. Um... Ooh, is there a 200 gold option? No. No? <clears throat> Just the oh. 100 gold. I don't think that one will... that one will fly. Mm -hmm. Too high up for that shit. <laughs> uh, we've just come from Cormir. With business going so well there, we have brought a large sum of surplus money for your superiors. I'm sure they wouldn't wish to be kept waiting. That's funny, because last I heard, the Iron Throne was banned for operating in Cormir. Lion scum! I don't know how you've gotten this far, but you'll get no further! I stand ready. Darn. I'm going to work out some anger on you. Uh, wait a moment. Could you please tell me where I could find Rylthar? It's important that I speak to him. I've been given the runaround too long. Right old damn song Saravak seems to think he's in charge here. We must ask for a name before go telling the whereabouts of the Iron Throne higher-ups. Does someone want to take over Nortori? I'm not wary, and your Iron Throne high-ups answers to me. I've just arrived from Selgaunt in Sembia. The council hmm. wishes to know how things are faring. Now tell me where I can find Rialtar. Rialtar's in the upper offices at the moment. If you go up there, I'm sure you'll catch him. Good. Finally, I get a straight answer. Good guy, John. <laughs> Oh, mm -hmm. he didn't mind about the explosion. He's also not going upstairs, apparently. <laughs> oh, it's Emissary Tar. What's up, Tar? You gonna talk to her? At last, someone who looks like they could be of some assistance. The assorted boobs and dimwits around here have been very little help. <laughs> of course. How may I assist you, ma'am? Ma'am, this, ma'am, that, I have little desire to suffer through more of your flat gen gentility. You may call me Emissary Tar and direct me towards the nearest staircase. <laughs> They're right across the room. <laughs> I have some important business to conduct on the fifth floor on behalf of the Grand Dukes. The stairs? Why, yes, they lie behind me, not far from where we stand at all. Don't want a warner? Thank you, and goodbye. Fuck what did the what did the fat people say in the town? I missed them. <laughs> they said all sorts of things. Cook. Hello. You there? This is my kitchen, and I don't like any interlopers. So get out. Yes, Mr. Cook, sir. Yes, Chef. Hello, I must apologize for my fellow here, John. He just gets irate real easy. You do best to avoid him when he's in these kind of moods. Yeah, no kidding. Yes, it would be done. John's cray. Did you search this room for loots? Yep. Nothing. Uh, no. Nothing. Nothing. Right. The fort floor. Go the fort. Sure. The fart. You want some whiskey? Uh. Hey there, mate. Do you recognize you? Which is strange, considering I know we're here in the Iron Throne. I don't. Why are you telling me who you are? We're merchants just out of Symbia. Out of Symbia, eh? 
Well, if you're looking for Rattletower or Bruno's, you won't find them here. They're off to Candle Keep for some important business. Oh. Business. All right. Business. The business. What do you want? Oh. Whoa. What is this dude? What? <laughs> oh, here's. Mm, hello. You must be the city negotiators. Let me see on the list here. Emissary. Emissary Tower. Right on time, and pleasure to meet you. My name is Destus Gurn, Assistant Chief Accountant for the Iron Thrones Operations on the Sword Coast. Now, just a quick briefing on the negotiation procedures before you head on up the stairs. Thaldorn will be accompanied by a board of six Iron Throne advisors sent to us from abroad. Zalamar Cloudwolf, Gardouche, Naman, Diab, Asim, and Ally, all of them quite respectable men and eager to meet you. We also have a seventh member on that board today, a Mr. Lyle Espejo. He is there to ensure that things go smoothly in this time of transition. As for the agenda... Please, Mr. Gurn, I have my own copy of the agenda. No desire to waste any more time here than necessary. If you would be so kind as to allow me to proceed upstairs with the negotiations, I would be very grateful. Yes, true. Very well, then, I'm sorry, Tab. Proceed upstairs and don't allow me to keep you here a moment longer. Great things are afoot, and I am very proud to have met you on behalf of the Iron Throne, and I hope, for everyone's sake, that the negotiations proceed swiftly. Yes, thank you. I need an arrow. Why me? Trapped in a corner. I was a child. So are we going just like straight upstairs? No. Oh, look at all these books. Yeah. Oh, I want to loot this room. Flame arrow, hold what? person. What? 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 Scrolls and scrolls and scrolls and scrolls. Scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. Protection scroll. Some other scrolls. Book and book and book and book and book. All right, I checked all the right hand ones there. Okay. Anything I don't know? Oh, that's all books on this side. No, I don't think so. Huh. I stand with ease. Oh well. Oh well. Okay. Oh, well. Uh, is your lore high enough to know what this spear is? Oh, what are you doing? Uh, I... Fear my wrath, for it is a great indeed. Who dares intrude upon my our negotiations? Uh, that's emissary tar right there. Yep. <coughs> Maybe we could get him to kill her. Be like, we're emissary tar. We're the real emissary tar. Um, what do you think? I don't know. I don't know how I teleported over here though. Oh wait, am I even up here yet? No. No. Okay, thank God. My name is Emissary Tar. I'm here to negotiate an iron treaty with Thaldorn on behalf of the Grand Dukes. How many <laughs> Emissary Tars do we have now? Three? Fool, Miss Tar stands right before you and she was just leaving, weren't you? My dear. Honestly, this has gone on long enough. Uh. No, oh, I don't think the coin would work. <laughs> You could pick three. I'm quite sorry to have bothered you. Really? Is this the exit? I'll just be going now. This is an exit of sorts, and you will indeed be leaving. I would hazard a guess that the situation shall be a bit more permanent than you would have liked. Long ago you crossed the line that would have allowed for your survival. So it has been ordained, so it shall come to pass. So commands Sarawak. I guess they know who we are. Mm, Are those zombies? I'm dropping some balls. Doppelganger. I seem Diab. Alright, here you drop that fireball. Drop it like it's hot. Yes? Oof. I stand ready. Hmm? Um, Somebody stop him! I guess I'll just pop one of these out while we're standing here. Yeah, pop it out. Rub one out, John. You ready? Yeah. Oh, I popped it out. Don't worry. Yes? Oh, maybe I should throw... At one of the casters there. There we go. Okay, they're both interrupted. Are you dropping another one, or are we good? Uh, yeah, sure, I'll throw another down. Okay. One, uno mas. Uno mas. Oh, they're casting something, I'm scared. Oh god. Is that a dimension door? Yeah. Okay. Right. Take it away, boys. Oh, Gardush is closing in on Archer Dartman. Gardush. Okay, I'll back up a little bit. Oh. He ran for me. Oh, that's a big pillar of fire you're standing in. Flame strike, eh? 
<laughs> think your gods can save you now. I stand ready. Not a problem. Why are they running so slow? Hmm? Slow. Not a problem. <laughs> I guess it's not really the answer you were looking for, but... Oh. Is that what it was? Yeah. Oh, okay. Am I standing in mud? Yeah, stop. Nice. Well done, everybody. Yeah! Oh, You're okay. acidic, John. Oh, you got acid. I don't think I have a cure for acid. Oh, the antidote on the force. Antidote work? Oh. It's gone. Just let it ride. Ooh, a halbeard, a scroll. Take a look at that halbeard there, Dirtman. Dirtster. Dirtman. Or, I mean, take a look at the scroll. Oh, a scroll. I have a task for you and those you have selected. You, the first of the faithful, are to stand ground in my stead. Be assured that I would not belittle your devotion with simple guard duty. This chore is of particular interest to me, and thus to you. Archer Dartman has become a thorn in my side. I wish it removed. Do so, and you shall please me greatly. Such is your charge. Do not fail in this. Saravok. Mm. Lots of potions on the ground, too, by the way. And some magic items. Yeah. Say, plus... What the fuck? What's happening? What? Sorry, I'm just sure took dying. Hey, I learned Minor Sequencer. There's, and, uh, I think there's say, traps around, by the way. Plus two Halberd. Oh, and I got Edventar's Gift, a ring of free action. Wow. Hmm. <clears throat> Who should we give that to? Oh, it affects haste as well. Um, I found maybe two for gain. Because he's got the boots of the cheetah, so he doesn't really need haste. I just there put a go. Magical Warhammer in your Ooh, return. Yeah, dying. Will be done. Nobody. Uh, I don't know, I keep hearing that, right? But Damage taken. Just, uh, plus one Warhammer. Oh my god, Emissary Tara's corpse. She's <laughs> dead? She's dying? No, she's, she's already dead. I don't know who's Her taking damage. Dying? But... It's none of us. Uh, I got an oil, oil of fiery burning, I'm just gonna throw it at Kagain. And uh, oil of perception, which I'll also throw at Kagain. Um, The ring of free action does not work with the boots. Uh, also, the uh, is full, didn't we already go over this? I don't know. What do you want me to do with them? Uh, I just failed to learn two spells. I guess, if you want to throw them back. Um, I keep on hearing the pain noise, and it's like... Yeah, it's, it's someone's taking a shit ton of damage. I don't hear the pain nope. noise, but I'm seeing it in the uh, in the log. Yeah. Jason, I gave you a Warhammer as well. Let me see. Yeah, it's plus one. I gave it to somebody oh, okay. else. Never mind. I thought it would actually be good. <laughs> Got some more scrolls for KG. God, oh, I was trying to... Take stuff out of my thing. Oh, sorry. You fucking jerk. Owie. Okay. Oh my god, there's tons of magic items on this guy. Uh, Do you want me to give him bail off or you? Uh, or me. Give to you. There's, I gave you some potions of explosions there if you want, John. Ooh. Potions of explosion? Yeah, it's like What do I do? EM shield plus one. Do I just use it and then throw it? Yeah. Hmm. Uh, Kagane can't take any more weapons or anything. He's over encumbered. Oh. Okay, I can, you can throw them on me. I have plenty of room. <clears throat> the only thing limiting me is the inventory slots. <laughs> oh my god. The world's edge. <laughs> It's every time I pick something up off the ground, he gets hurt. Is it? Plus one mace. What yeah. Happened? What the hell? Go pick this. Who gets hurt? You, apparently. But Me? You don't actually. It just, you go, ah, and it says you took damage. Jeez. Uh, uh, weird. Weird right. glitch. That oh, shit. Hello. I don't want any trouble. What are you doing here? Get out of this building before I call the guards. You can't do that until you answer us some questions. You're gonna kill me, are you? You can't kill me. Do you know who I am? I'm Faldorn, one of the leaders of the Iron Throne.
Where can we find documents that will implicate your organization for its involvement with the bandit raids and iron shortage? Tell us or die. Please don't hurt me. You can find everything you need with Rythar. He's the true leader of the operation. He always carries everything on his person. Am I free to go? Where is Rieltar? The other leaders, Bruno and Rieltar, they're at Candle Keep, <laughs> tending business with some benefactors mm. from the south. You, will you let me go now, please? Let's kill him. <clears throat> hmm. No. What do you guys think? Kill him? I don't know. The first one. What's the first one? Tell us where he's Same thing we already asked. Oh. I don't know. I don't know, man. I, I'm kind of a ranger who's kind of good, so I'm kind of inclined to say you're free to go, but, you know, I'm not the one talking to him. <clears throat> mm. Yeah, tough call. Tough call. Tough call. I mean, I mean if his killed or everybody if, else. Yeah, if his organization collapses, he doesn't have much power. But That's true. he might have items on him. Um... Hmm. You're free to go. Quick, kill him! The party of Archer Darman's running over a new leaf. Yep. What do we got in here? Nothing in this place. A little desk with a couple notes and some spells. Cute. And then a wardrobe with nothing. Wow, this place had tons of loot that I care so much about. Rialta, my superiors are intrigued by your proposal. I would like to discuss it further, but not through correspondence such as this. The Harpers and Zents have been very active in this region of late. It would be very unfortunate if they tried to disrupt an alliance between our two organizations. If you, Brunos, and Thaldorn were to meet with us in the safety of Candlekeep, my superiors would be much relieved. Please send a response ASAP, Tuth. Where is the staircase mm. down? <clears throat> Another Just behind the staircase up. Oh, it's behind it. Father, I received your letter, and I can assure you that the mercenaries led by Archer Dartman will no longer trouble our operations. I have dealt with them personally. Before dying, they were most forthcoming in their revelations. It is as you had surmised. They were agents of the Zentrum. I am also writing to tell you that I cannot attend the meeting at Candlekeep. Some problems have arisen with the Chill and the Black Talons. They have had trouble working with each other, and I am needed there to smooth over any dissension. I'm sorry that I will not be at your side, Saravok. Why would he tell his father Did that we get doppelgangers? Zents. Mm. Did you just get attacked by doppelgangers? Is that what you just said? No, no. Were we, did we get doppelganged? Like, did some doppelgangers pretend to be us and then go mm. fight Saravok? Huh. Or something. Sounds like he's just lying to his dad. With ease. Mm. Daddy, it's okay! What a liar. It will be done. Oh, oh. Poop face liar. Oh, daddy's boy. With ease. More like a baddie's boy, am I right? Oh. Uh, yeah. You are right. Oh. You're not wrong. You're not wrong, Walter. I've never been writer. Walter Darman. <laughs> Don't call me that. Who told you? <clears throat> now serve the oh. flaming oh. fist. Hello, little friends. May I have a word? Relax, I'm not here to hurt you. I know you've been attacked at almost every turn, but I am an ally, true and sure. Well, that stranger, what news do you bring? I am just a aide of Tuscar. His wish was that I keep an eye on you, though you seem more than capable of taking care of yourselves. I do think, however, that you would benefit from visiting with him. He should await you at the Flaming Fist headquarters in the southwest the south left corner of the city. If he's not there, just speak directly to Duke Elton. Alright. Then I shall proceed forthwith. Good travels to you. I take my leave. Yes, with you. Au revoir. He just goes into the Iron Throne. Yeah. <laughs> he's gonna loot the place where he yeah, wants to, but we already did. <laughs> he can get those scraps. <laughs> you can oh, find the bodies helmet. in the basement. <laughs> With ease. Oh, main equipment, yes! Yeah. I serve the flaming feast. I serve the flaming feast. How many times were we attacked by flaming fist? A lot. There's yeah, like hey, three? We can, uh, four. Go past someone else. We can what? We can loot this. Right. This uh, fountain over here. 
Hmm. Isn't that hard, Gandalf? Is there oh, coins? Is there gold? Gem. Oh, a gem. Who's throwing gems in the fountain? <laughs> Throw some nice shit in there. People are stupid. Where the hell is Scar? Is this you, Scar? I, I have the gem pick, by the way. Phyllis? Dillos, get out of our way. Fergus. Did we go to the right place? Maybe Scar's outside and we passed him. Or maybe we have he's gone and we have to talk to the Duke. Where's the Duke? I don't even see the Duke. Yeah, where was he? In the Duke? his Palace. Isn't he a Duckle Palace? Did you find a secret door? Not yeah. <laughs> he's not down here. It's just a trap. Any loot? I don't know, there's a dude watching. <laughs> Looking at us. <laughs> yeah, there's no doors in here, it's just... There's a door, but you can't open it. Yeah, but yeah, I'm, I'm using tab to, like, highlight things. Oh, and there's a, there's a room back there, too. Where oh, shit, Jason just went upstairs. Where'd I go? What? Upstairs? What do I do? Oh, here's the Duke. Where's upstairs? Oh, there it is. Right. Doesn't even look like stairs. <laughs> <laughs> Hello! I am Duke I'm glad to have you back, so what have you learned so far? Uh... uh we know that any incriminating evidence would be found with Raltar, the overall leader of the Iron Throne, in Baldur's Gate. He currently is, he's currently supposed to be at Candlekeep on some sort of business. And there is only one thing to do. Travel to Candlekeep and learn what they're doing. Whatever it is, it can't be bo can't bode well for the fortunes of the city. Take this book. Without it, the keep of the portal won't allow you entrance into the library. Here also is the reward money that I've promised you. We didn't finish the job, but thank you. Oh. Oh, shit. Is it forcing us to travel? Where you must spy upon the leaders of the Iron Throne. While it troubles you that such evil men now make use of the Great Library, and you wish the circumstances of your visit would be different, it will still be a pleasure to return to your former home. Hmm. Oh. That's it? We're outside Candle Keep. Yeah, they forced us to travel. I thought as much. What if we needed to buy mm -hmm. things? There was an option. That says I still have th some things to take care of in town. Oh. I also thing. have a magical book in my inventory. The ancient book of knowledge. Jason, would you like to identify this? I would have liked to get rid of this dead child before he came here. Put it on the ground. <laughs> I'm actually out of identifies right now. You can pass it to Bayloth, or we can just. He's out of identifies. Use your lore. Uh, your lore might do it for this me. spear. Alright, I'm gonna look. Spear plus one. Always, always just rest right here. Book of Ancient Knowledge. Let's have a little nap. Yeah, sure. It's a lovely day. That's a lovely night. Uh, hey, hey, hey. Hey. So I've got a... A wand of the heavens. Heavenly. Heavenly That'll be good wand. for John. Why? Mm -hmm. And uh, this book... This book is the history of the Nether Scrolls. Well, there's anything I've like got the some other scrolls. scrolls for you. Hmm. What does that mean, John? Right here. <laughs> John, in a person. <laughs> hey, John, do you want this ring of free action? Uh, sure. Yeah, good call. Not using any other ring, really. Ninja To plus one. Ninja To. Ninja To. Why do I have this book again? Here's your wand, John. Oh, thanks, man. No worries. I don't think I can use this. It's a red. It's got a red outline. Well, I can't use it. Not usable by Bard, Fighter, Mage, Paladin, Ranger. I'm so oh, sorry. Oh, so stupid. Oh, who can't use a... Uh... Oh. Rangers. That sucks. Super Thanks dumb. for selling it at some point. But my inventory is my inventory is packed full now. So it's don't not even a ranger it. anymore. No, it's daytime. Um, should we go sell stuff or? <laughs> can we leave? Yeah, I think so. We could just go into Candlekeep and sell stuff to uh, Winthrop. That's true. I can keep holding on to this dead kid. <laughs> sell him to the dead kid. Just drop him where Garin was standing. Yeah. <laughs> when we left. Alright. Hold, travelers! 
Before you will be allowed entrance, you must donate a tome of great value to our libraries. This guy's intense. We have the book you require, Keeper of the Portal. You have met the requirements to gain entry to our most holy library. It is fine to see the child of Gorion once again within these shallowed halls. Please have less... Please have your less civilized friends re refrain from causing trouble. We are very strict with the letter of the law, as you well know, Archer Dogman. Oh, alright. Not a problem. <laughs> this is where we left. Well, uh, uh... Maybe we should call this episode here. And then, uh, we will see you next time in Candle Keep and Let's Play Baldur's Gate Enhanced Edition Co-op with John and Jason. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Uh -huh.